Top 20 System Administrator Microsoft Interview Questions and Answers. All but first questions are in random orders with some positional relevance to make it easier to follow. Answers are specifically worded to make it as simple as possible to understand without losing meaning. Median salary for Microsoft System Administrator is 60,000 US dollars in United States. Question number one. Can you tell me about yourself? To answer this question properly, provide any information about you that is related to system administrator position. Talk about any experience, education, or certifications. Do not speak of things that are not related, for example, hobbies. For a detailed guide to this question, follow the link below. Question number two. Explain the role of Windows Server. Windows Server is an operating system that uses a centralized computer that provides specific functions, predetermined rules for users, and computers connected to a network. Question number three. What is Windows Domain? Windows Domain is a centralized location for user accounts, computers, printers, and security features as part of database controlled by a domain controller. Question number four. What is DNS and which port does it use? DNS stands for Domain Name System, and it's mostly used to interpret domain names into numeric IP address. DNS uses port 53 TCP or UDP. Question number five. How many queries does DNS perform and which ones? DNS performs two types of queries, iterative and recursive. Question number six. What is Active Directory? A service of Windows Server operating system, Active Directory is used for user and computer authentication within a domain. It can also enforce security policies and install software to computers connected to a domain. Question number seven. Active Directory database is located where? Using file name ntds.dit, it is located in the system root folder ntds. Question number eight. What is a lingering object? If an object is deleted from Active Directory while the main controller is offline, it can create a lingering object. When object is deleted from Active Directory, a tombstone, which is a temporary file, is created, which then has to be replicated by the main controller before it expires. Question number nine. How do you back up Active Directory? Active Directory can be backed up by using NT Backup Tool that comes with 2003 server. With 2008 server, a command prompt is used to perform backup. Type WB admin space start space system state backup space dash backup target colon e colon question 
Question number 10. Do you know what garbage collection is? Garbage collection is a process designed to free space inside Active Directory. This is performed by default every 12 hours, a defrag function. Question number 11. Do you know what sys vol folder is? System volume folder is a directory that houses a copy of the main files found on a local hard drive within the main controller. This data is shared for purpose of replication across the main, for example, user logon scripts and Windows group policy. Question number 12. What is RAID? Stands for Redundant Array of Independent Disks and is used to provide data redundancy mirroring across multiple hard disks. It can also be utilized to improve read-write performance across the server by using striping configuration. For example, RAID 1 two or more disks with identical data stored redundancy. RAID 0, two or more disks, data distributed evenly to improve performance, no redundancy. Question number 13. Which commands would you use in command prompt to test network connectivity? To test network connectivity, ping and IP config commands are used. Question number 14. What does IntelliMirror do? As part of Windows Server operating system, IntelliMirror provides assistance in managing user data, computer information, applications, and settings. This is used by user group policy that defines business roles, group memberships, and locations. For example, if a user moves to a different computer, the applications, settings, and stored files will follow. Question number 15. Explain what group policy is. A group policy is used to control users' desktops and computer configuration by creating a default template for specific members of the group. This makes it easier to control and process large groups of users. Question number 16. Can you name different types of email servers? And which ports do they use? You can have two types of email servers. Incoming mail server, POP3, port 110, IMAP, port 143, HTTP, port 80. You can also have outgoing mail server, SMTP that uses port 25. Question number 17. What is the difference between a forest and a domain? A domain is a logic-based group of computers, users, and devices within Active Directory. A tree is a collection of domains. In case there are multiple trees formed, a forest is created. Question number 18. 
do you know what the virtual machine is? Virtual machine is an emulation version of operating system. You can have multiple copies of Windows Server running on a single hardware platform. This is mostly done through third-party software. Question number 19. Do you know what tattooing the registry means? Basically, the group policy will make the changes to user's registry, but once the group policy is no longer in effect, registry values do not revert back, leaving them tattooed in, sort of speak. Question number 20. Why should we hire you? This is your last chance to impress potential employer. Talk about any other experience that you may have related to this job. Mention things any employer could ask from their associates. For example, being dependable, hardworking, and being a team player. Friends, I know it can be hard to prepare for an interview and frankly nerve-wracking, but try to relax and answer all questions with confidence. It can be really hard to predict exact questions asked during an interview, so please study from many sources before taking up an interview to maximize your chances in succeeding. Also, don't forget to research the company beforehand. Lastly, if you find this video helpful in any way, please do me a favor back and visit facebook.com forward slash Kobuman and like my page. I would really appreciate it. Thank you for watching. Good luck and have a wonderful day.